So Tesla has just had their shareholder meeting and the fallout seems to point to good news for the share price, hence the positive aftermarket movements. So here is what my takeaways were for what went down. Hi again everyone, I hope you're doing well. So let me take you into the bustling city of Austin, Texas. A gathering of minds took place at the annual Tesla shareholder meeting. Uh, with Elon Musk at the helm, the event unfolded revealing several key takeaways that shed light on the future of the electric vehicle giant. So let's embark on a bit of a journey through some of the pivotal moments in my mind from this meeting. So as the room buzzed with anticipation, Elon Musk took to the stage. In his opening remarks, he struck a chord of caution, acknowledging that Tesla is not immune to the challenges of the global economic environment, and Musk foresaw difficult times ahead for the next 12 months, emphasizing the need for adaptability and resilience in the face of adversity. Car demand, a critical factor obviously in Tesla's success, became a focal point of discussion. Musk acknowledged the need for greater awareness of Tesla's vehicles, their affordability and amazing features and functionality that they offer. It was a turning point for the company as Musk announced their foray into traditional advertising, something that the company had otherwise normally avoided. The irony was not lost on CEO Elon Musk as, as the Tesla CEO is now obviously the owner of Twitter, a platform heavily reliant on ads for, for its revenue. Um, the strategic move aimed to ensure that the world recognizes the true potential of Tesla's groundbreaking electric cars, as well as the value that can be found when purchasing one at the moment. Tesla's commitment to ethical sourcing and sustainability also took center stage. Cobalt, a key ingredient in Tesla's batteries, raised concerns about the mining practices associated with its extraction. To address these worries, Musk pledged to conduct a third-party audit of the cobalt mines supplying Tesla. The Transparency Initiative aimed to ensure responsible sourcing and reinforce Tesla's commitment to environmental social responsibility. Um, amidst the excitement and anticipation, the meeting turned its gaze towards Tesla's leadership and succession plans. Uh, shareholders had proposed a report that sought to establish a clear plan for the future leadership of the company. However, the proposal was rejected, highlighting the trust and confidence placed in Elon Musk's visionary leadership. While concerns had been raised about the lack of a clear successor, the meeting did acknowledge J.B. Strobel, the co-founder and former chief technology officer of Tesla, as a potential candidate. His expertise and role as CEO of Redwood Materials, a battery recycling materials company, made him a viable contender to carry Tesla's torch into the future. Uh, the meeting also touched upon Elon Musk's involvement with Twitter, a social media platform that he acquired in a surprising move. Musk candidly admitted that his engagement with Twitter had been a distraction, leading him to perform major open heart surgery on the platform to secure its survival. In a significant development, Musk announced the appointment of Linda Yakarina, I think I said her name right there, a seasoned advertising veteran as the new CEO of Twitter. Uh, this strategic move not only allowed Musk to focus on Tesla's products and technology, but also set the stage for possible synergies between the two companies, especially given that Tesla is now looking to advertise more traditionally. Um, as the meeting drew to a close, the shareholders expressed their confidence in Tesla's trajectory. They swiftly voted to re-elect Musk and Chair Robin Denham um, as board members, reaffirming their trust in the current leadership. The shareholders' endorsement of the board recommendations highlighted their belief in the company's potential and vision of its founders. So the Tesla shareholder meeting served as a crucial moment of reflection and projection encapsulating the challenges and aspirations of the company. It also revealed Elon Musk's unwavering determination to navigate the volatile global economic landscape while ensuring Tesla's products reached a wider audience through traditional advertising. Uh, the commitment to sustainable sourcing and responsible mining practices showcased Tesla's dedication to environmental stewardship. Additionally, discussions surrounding leadership succession hinted at a future where J.B. Strobel, with his expertise and experience, could potentially step into the role sometime down the track if needed. So in the end, Tesla's shareholder meeting painted a vivid picture of a company charting its course amidst a rapidly evolving landscape. It highlighted the need for adaptability, innovation, and responsible business practices in an ever-changing world. Elon Musk's candid reflections, strategic decisions, and unwavering support of shareholders reinforced the notion that Tesla is not just an automaker, but a pioneering force shaping the future of transportation. So as the curtain falls on this chapter of Tesla's journey, one thing remains clear. The road ahead may be challenging, but the passion, determination, and ingenuity Elon Musk and the Tesla team will continue to propel the company towards a sustainable electrified future, um, and the impossible becomes possible.
let's hope. Anyway, there's my little optimistic take on what has gone down with the Tesla shareholder meeting. Please share your thoughts on what you think of this meeting um, in the comments below. I'd love to hear what you guys think. Um, and where do you think it leaves the stock price now that Elon Musk is more on board with Tesla and moving back a little bit from Twitter? Is this a generally positive thing or do you think the market conditions are still going to be quite challenging for the company moving forward? Share it in the comments below. Till next time, everyone. Man, Marcus, trade in your favour. Cheers.